internal review process to look at the viability of each of its varsity sports. So far, 16 of the 29 UBC athletic teams have been saved, but 13 programs remain on the chopping block, and hockey is one of them. Craig McEwen files this report. There is a movement afoot at the University of British Columbia to pare down and eliminate a number of varsity sports teams. The people I really feel for is the current student athletes because they're here, they've committed to being here and getting an education and competing for this team, and they're really uncertain as to what their future holds. This is tradition, and this is culture, this is what it's all about, and we want to make sure it keeps going. It was just four short years ago that UBC helped host an Olympic Games with a brand new rink left behind as a lasting legacy. But now there's a chance that this venue will lose its top tenant if the school decides to cut the hockey program. It would be huge to, to keep varsity hockey in, in BC. I know we're the only team at that level right now. And obviously us staying in the CIS is, is really important for us. It's been something I've been able to look forward to uh, trying to come play here um, all throughout my career, uh, right from minor hockey growing up in the city. Um, so it's been a pretty cool experience for me. UBC hockey has had a long and storied history on the Point Grey campus. In fact, our country's highly successful Canadian national team program was started at the school back in the 1960s, created by Father David Bauer, who ended up taking his group of UBC hockey players to represent Canada at the 1964 Olympics in Innsbruck, Austria. People came from, from Regina, people came from Trail, BC. Um, they had players from all over the country that uh, really became the first um, fully Canadian national team. It's the highest level of amateur hockey in BC. We're the only university uh, varsity team that plays in BC. These players, we have uh, 15 Western Hockey League players that are local and their parents want to see them, their families want to see them, and it's important for them to stay here. In the push to save the program, the local hockey community has stepped up big time. That list includes the NHL Canucks and a number of BC-based Western Hockey League teams, including the Vancouver Giants, Kamloops Blazers, and Victoria Royals, who even talked about UBC's plate at the recent major junior governor's meetings in Las Vegas. Craig McEwen, Sportsnet. Vancouver.